Day six, guys, and we ran into these beautiful Icelandic horses. Look at this gorgeous creature. So photogenic they are. Phonogenic, sorry. How are you enjoying the horses, sweetheart? Yeah? Yep. Gorgeous animals. And this view is uh, quite something as well. Isabel's uh, taking a long exposure of this really cool looking rock. It's really interesting how you have something like this just sitting like here. Very cool. As well, check out how black this sand is. It's incredibly dark. And your hand doesn't get dirty. It's the weirdest thing. Look at that. Fascinating. Fascinating, fascinating. Another one of those odd things you see nicely. There's a jellyfish in the water. Look. Crazy. And another jellyfish. Hey, should I grab it? You want me to grab it? This is day seven. 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 Day seven. So, we got lucky probably just one day that we had rain around this time, which is what, what time is it right now? <clears throat> it is almost 8 p.m. So, we had one day, nice day outside we were sitting, and now these days we've been doing just this hanging out in the car, waiting for the time <laughs> to go to bed. <laughs> because outside looks like absolute crap and it's been raining pretty gray. and oh pretty much every time we're camping we are just it's raining and cold and wet yeah. so from tomorrow on we have just three more nights we are gonna stay in guest houses it's a little bit more money but it's just not i don't know we're getting old <laughs> How many nights? I'm waking up tired. Five nights in camping in the cold and wet. I think it's oh, enough. Oh, Jesus. It's been five nights? I don't know. Is it? One, two, three. Yeah. Oh, yeah. This is the fifth night. Jesus. Yeah, five nights of camping. Let's check my notes. In the cold, wet ground. So, we stayed at a campsite. We stayed at a campsite. No. Campsite. 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 Number one beer in Iceland. Three nights. Where do we stay at? A, at a town? I mean, in that. What's the name of it? In the hostel? Oh, right. Isla Forder. We stayed, we stayed one night in the hostel. Yeah, so five nights, I think, we've been camping or something like that. Right. In the rain, uh, yeah, it's too much. It's getting too cold. We don't have uh, appropriate sleeping bags because we both have down sleeping bags. And for humidity, they're not good at all. They're warm, but I don't know. 
the ten conversation yeah. rain outside it's getting cold and everything it, it just doesn't help at all every morning we wake up and you feel and the thing is it's like cold to the bone you wake you wake up kind of cold and damp but then you're driving for hours on end and it's kind of tiring yeah so but, that's pretty much these days yeah we yeah. hang out in the car because well this time we have a really good kitchen and dining area <clears throat> but there's other guys that need to use those tables to have dinner so we just came here and now probably but also we're super lucky because in iceland when you get a tenting camping spot you'll generally have a shelter that's heated and you you'll have your bathrooms in there a stove if you're lucky they usually have something even even a hot plate something like that uh, a kettle to boil water not all of them had a kettle but probably the majority yeah had a kettle so we're really i mean if we didn't have that little shelter jesus i don't know what we would have done <laughs> just, well, hang, just hang out in a car somewhere no yesterday happened the same thing we got to the, this camping uh site and the the one that is gotten that's supposed to be the kitchen and kind of dining room is under it was under construction so we just went in there to see okay just to yeah. I don't know, just stand up for a little bit because we well, were driving, of course, most of the day. So we're just sitting down and we didn't want to be, again, in the car for too long. So we just went there, okay, let's see if it's open. It was it was heated inside, so we just stayed there for, a, I don't know, like half an hour, maybe? Well, maybe, just maybe close to an hour. <laughs> just there standing, okay, let's wait, and then let's wait, and then we went um, hang on the car and then went, went to sleep, but... But yeah, yeah, yesterday was just that one that we couldn't stay too long in there in case more people were going to start coming in because it was under construction. But yeah, so that's the update for day seven. Day seven. Um, it's been good, but we just, mm, I don't know, weather-wise, we weren't that lucky. And also, I, I didn't feel much stuff today. I don't think I really feel much of anything, like a few little clips here and there. I, I was way too tired. I yeah, so... and that's a problem when you sleep bad and then putting yeah. driving on that and on top of that and waking up early, waking up in the middle of the night. And yeah, because I, I woke up in the middle of the night because uh, we had our tent underneath a tree. And then as the rain droplets were falling off the tree, they were heavy. So you could, you could you hear it hitting that. the fly, the tent just bang, bang, bang. And I was like, oh my God. You feel all that just drop. <clears throat> but uh, yeah, so you have a few options of uh, camping if you want to, renting camper vans. Which ones you have? Mini, big ones, like a truck, if you have the money. What other options yeah. you have? Hostels, if you. You're okay paying yeah. 100 plus per night. If you're in a couple, you save more money. Yeah, definitely. Uh, I, I I don't even think we met anyone doing this solo. No. It's, <laughs> yeah, it's, mo it's mostly couples. Everyone is either a couple or like a group of four or three. Yeah. But like a one person, one, I uh -huh. met zero. No, I don't think I met a single no. person here. No. That's by themselves, yeah. No, not, not on. No, in the whole uh, time we've been in the no. room. No, it's no. always couples, yeah. Maybe Iceland is the country of romance. <laughs> well, I guess if you need someone to drive. But in this case, I'm not driving. It's just him. So that's why. Yeah. <laughs> that's why hostels from now on. Three more oh, nights. Oh, there was one, one camping site <laughs> maybe about three nights ago. Uh, it was that town that the gas station wasn't open and the restaurant wasn't open and we couldn't pay for the campsite. The free one. Oh, what's the name of that? Anyway, not important. This was like three, four nights ago. It was so windy. I turned my head as I was sleeping and I got punched in the face by the tent. The wall of the tent from the wind, the wall of the tent came and just smacked me in the face. I was like, okay, I'm up. I'm up. <laughs> what time was that? All right. Uh, at seven in the morning? Yeah, I was probably around that time. It was, it was, in, the, it was in the morning when that happened. I was kind of just waking up and then bam, I got slapped in the face by the tent. It was kind of funny. <laughs> I think it was in, it was day four. Day four? Maybe, yeah. Mm. The one we didn't pay. Yeah. I don't know. Like, 
I enjoy the places and everything, but then I forget the next day. What, what there's there's so much going on. Have you guys seen the videos before? There's so much going on. Yeah. There's so many sites. Like, if I had more time in Iceland, you, you could stop every five minutes and take a photo or see something interesting or there's a new site to see. Like, it's there's a lot in this country. It's uh, Oh, it's pretty good. It's a pretty majestic place, I gotta say. People here don't do the small talk, but they're nice if you need help with something. Yeah, yeah, they're, yeah. They're, they're gonna super, smile uh, at you and help you. Any questions or anything like that, they're really, yeah. uh, they're very helpful. If that's what it's like. Yeah, exactly. So, yeah. they're not very much of if you go and get in a store, they're gonna be, oh, hello, how are you? But as soon as you pay, and then we were at a liquor store the other day, my beer fell off the oh, yes, this little one. package. Iceland's, of the um, plastic. we bought a six pack of this. Yeah. yeah, and the beer, like the lady when we went in, she didn't say hello or anything, they didn't even look. Who came in but then as soon as we pay and then the beer fell on the ground she just got up right away and see oh you okay, it was okay. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah things so. like that people are nice um anyone actually not just because in the city there's immigrants too but even yeah it, it's, it's hard to tell who's from iceland and who's mm -hmm. uh, yeah they have a lot of Russian immigrants here. Mm. And I have a hard time telling who's Icelandic yeah. and who's Russian. It's, it's yeah, because I don't know the Icelandic language and I don't know Russian. So if they say one sentence, I don't know what's going on. <laughs> yeah, but, so know. the little updates while well, we're here hanging out in the car. It's kind of dark, getting dark right yeah. now. Um, is there anything else we can say? No. I would say um, coming to Reykjavik, the airport, it seemed like it, the majority of the people working there were from Russia. They were immigrants. Yeah. And then the guy driving the bus to the city. And then even the city center, it seemed like a lot. The guy that rented the car, he was he was Russian he was too. Russian probably, yeah. But then as soon as you start doing the ring road and you go to diff these different sites, then it's more, um, you meet more Icelandic people. You meet more. Yeah. Yeah, the people from here. So yes. Yeah, that's, that's kind of interesting. Day seven, uh, rain mostly. Get a few yeah, breaks it, here and there. Today was all rain. <laughs> no, why the car is leaving? The light was so good. <laughs> so yeah, a little back We're there. probably gonna go to bed soon. Probably around nine. <laughs> Cause at this point, so yeah, we're gonna we're gonna wake up early anyway. Yeah. Because we're cold or I don't know wet. Or Time to go to bed on the cold, wet ground. Yeah. <laughs> so that's it. Day seven. Day seven. From the car. Ciao.